We, we can go with that. Shadow was the name of that one. And Golbez was like, yeah. feast Shadow. And Shadow just starts one shot. Just, just yeah, power. eating everybody. Nice. Wow. Nice. Also wow. Alright, well. That was an excellent start to things. Yeah, no kidding. Especially for not being able to use any attack magic. Yeah, I'd be mad if I were you too, Dragon. <laughs>《Yeah, uh, I think we're okay. I think we're gonna make it out of this one just fine, guys. — Like your odds. — And another wow. crit. — The crits are real so far. I thought that was another one before the... — Oh, there's another crit. — I think this does more damage. — Yeah. — Yeah, single target. Still not anything to really worry about. — Still has 200 health. Yeah, just, just have next turn when he's unbalanced. Yeah, just have Victor heal. Yeah. No crits? Aw, oh, no crits. Yeah, it's gonna happen. Who's getting it this time? Eh, let him heal himself. Or not. It, 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 yeah, I, either way. I severely overestimated this fight. I mean, I may as well have him heal someone. He's not doing anything else. This is uh, not the strongest dragon in the world. They seem to have taken your party composition into account. Yeah, which is good. It'd be kind of awful to give you like, no casters and just completely bone you right. by giving you something that does like, ridiculous AoE damage, which which happens later in the game. There are definitely some character, some boss fights that if you don't have a heal, you're kind of boned. Kinda. Not, not especially boned. Oh, cruel fate, to be thusly boned. Ask not for whom the bone bones, it bones for thee. <laughs> Alright, can this thing just die already? Yeah, it's not a particularly interesting fight. I'm sorry to say. Oh, he got hurt by that one. Well, now uh, Victor definitely has somebody to heal. Right. I almost want him to just heal himself. He's, he's not doing much damage. Boom. Oh. Hey, it can dodge. It can. Get him. Oh, good grief. That was a good time to do that. <laughs> uh, yeah, heal yourself. And I, w I would have Gremio heal himself, but he's kind of been doing work on this guy. Such a deep rune. Oh, bother. Oh, man. This I is, will uh... tell you, the front row definitely does a good job of taking all the attacks. Yeah. They do that. Hey, you can heal Gremio. Die. Die. Why won't you die? There, there we go. go. Okay. No, that's something I've always liked about the, uh, this game. Is you can get the healing afterwards, which is it's really... Thanks. Interesting. Is, really, well, it's, it's nice because, like... Especially for, like, random encounters, you don't have to, like, worry about healing mm -hmm. in between. You can... <laughs> sort of. What's an assassination door behind the throne? <laughs> Alright, let's just make sure this is here so that during any uh, important meeting somebody can sneak through it and uh, shank the king. Right. Alright, so important thing to hear. Make sure your main character is well equipped and fully healed. Because... Because we are going to see the third form of combat here. Ooh, neat. Third and final form of combat. Yeah. All right, Quanda Roseman, one on one, let's go. Hey, you remember me? A capital R rebel leader, huh? 
No, that's a lowercase r rebel leader. Show me the proper respect. That's right. He's uh, he's spurning your movement by not giving it the proper capitalization. Also, I think he left an S off of Barbarossa's name. Um, uh, an S like Rosa with two S's. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds right. Well, that can't oh, possibly be anything bad. He's got a different rune. Yep. So the third form of combat is a duel. Which is kind of, which is also rock paper scissors based. The way it works is you look at whatever the enemy says, mm -hmm. which in this case that's their intro script. Victory is near. I strike with all my might. So clearly he's doing the all-out attack. Yeah, there are th there are three uh, actions yet again. You can do a normal attack, which beats defense. You can defend, which beats uh, a desperate attack, which is what he's about to do. Or if they're going to just attack you, you can use a desperate attack and do more damage than them. So you he, would defend in this case? Yeah, in this case, he's he just said he's going to go all out against me. So what defend does in this case... It's is, a nice little counter hit. Yep. Alright, now by him saying he underestimated or does, I'm pretty sure he's going to defend, so just do a... No, oh, he's going to no, attack. So it's a push. Yeah. And he doesn't do a whole lot to us, so... First one's pretty easy to win. So it sounds like he's gonna go nuts again. Yep. Whoop! Wrecked. Alright, so that's. I don't, I'm not sure if that's a normal attack or a desperate attack. Let's just defend and see. Yep. Okay, another desperate. You know, you're coming off as a little desperate. <laughs> Three of his four attacks have been desperate. Alright, so All right. now he's thinking carefully. So he's going to defend. Yep. Yep. <laughs> and it ends. Did I do enough through that? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. And you've now seen all of the combat Suikoden has to offer. Although I will say the sky here is not moving at all. <laughs> so in world combat, it moves super fast. In regular combat, it moves a little. In one-on-one, -on -one, it doesn't move at all. Time So there's a direct still. relationship between the number of people in a fight and the speed of the sky pop. I'll allow it. What a... Yeah, you never used the black rune. What, what is we it just even... had a physical melee. Uh, kobold. Oh, so the black rune was to. Hello. Ah, that's not good. Well, let's not let him do the thing. Uh oh. Oh. Well, that, that ended poorly for him. Indeed. Bye! Can no, we stop. take the rune? No, you can't take the rune. It exploded on him. Oh. Oh, this trope. Revenge for what? For enslaving that one's people and completely destroying their city for the, for the other? I don't remember any burned out tree. <laughs> So you can't even call that a tree anymore. Hey, wait a minute. Yeah, hold on. Yes. Alright, so remember when I killed Crazy? Right. Don't do that here. Yeah, this is not one of those kill crazy moments. Yeah, Crazy is the one time you can kill someone and get away with it and not have an effect on the ending. From this point on... If you get this message for the for a, for a character like nice. this, be nice because they're one of your hundred and eight. Spoiler alert. They have a portrait. He does have a portrait, but he was a villain. Lop off his head. Yeah. You mean you mean who my said head? that? Oh. I'm. I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be like. Is it Valeria that was supposed to say that or? Interesting. Yeah. Because she forced herself into our party. Uh, that's that seems like a botch. Yeah, well, it happens a few times in this game. Hmm. Uh huh. Oh, really? What tipped you off that the evil cackling witch sorceress couldn't be trusted? Was it the fact that she enslaved you? Maybe the fact that she murdered my friend? I don't know. Mm, she was also kind of rude to your dad, if I remember. <laughs> oh, 
Also, why does he have a Met hat? Like, you notice that? Like, yeah. His helmet has the same cross on the like the front. I have no idea, but let's get him to join us instead. Put his talents to good. Wow, it really is a, a Met hat, right? Huh? That's what I was like. I'm looking at it, and I'm like, I'm picturing his special ability is to like to stand up, shoot, and then duck again. This guy got pretty far in the military for only ten years service. It's true. I mean, he's like, he's like one of the five leaders of the military. Oh, so we know the time frame of his change was seven years ago. Yeah. So seven years ago, I'll tell you this right now. Seven years ago was the uh, was an overthrow of the Scarlet Moon Empire, or no, this is the Scarlet Moon Empire. Right. Yeah. Whatever was before was overthrown by a Barbarossa. And everyone was happy for a little while. Yes. Sure. Okay. And the first mission is a resounding success. Oh. Uh, we cleaned up all the dead bodies while you were gone. <laughs> right. The thousands and thousands of them. Hey, more kobolds. Cool. I assume that means Cobalt Town is populated again? Yes. Uh, you're welcome. I can't say the same for Health Town. <laughs> <laughs> like, I see, like, all the dogs you've had together, and, like, Kirkus turns, like, to the side, like, Elves? Elves? Yay? <laughs> Doesn't happen. It just, the camera turns to the, to the, just the, back the, to the burnt the out stump. <laughs> it's like another piece of it just falls off onto the ground. <laughs> Hey, there we go. We're getting plenty of people. Yeah. We ended up getting like six people out of this venture. No, Kirkus, I'm explaining this to you. We have a tower. Lots of people that join the Liberation Army just stay in there. And you know what doesn't happen in the tower? It doesn't get shelled out and burned to a crisp. <laughs> I don't know, I'm still 15. Hey, at least he respectfully calls it Rain Castle. Alright, unfinished business just means we don't auto-port back to Castle? Yes, because there are people to recruit along the way. Yes. Which we can do in the call today, I think. Yeah, it sounds good. So, we've got a couple flashing places to go. Yeah, well, so up and to the right was the Dwarf Trail. Mm -hmm. uh, down to the right was the tower or the castle we were just at and we've done everything there no one ever shows up there again the elf thing's done yeah oh it's I mean, done it's, it's as done as, <laughs> it's, it's well done it's as done as one could possibly imagine things being done so we'll head back to Cobalt Town and there's a second Cobalt yeah yes so first thing let's head to the inn and talk to this guy that is not the second kobold. No. But he this is, is the Fusu second Lu. person to brag that he has the strength of 100 men. Don't pursue Fusu Lu. Does this mean if Fusu Lu and your former trainer arm wrestled, they'd be perfectly balanced because they each have the strength of 100 men? Oh, wow. But which men? That's true. I mean, we're talking like the strength of 100 Thor Magnusons or 100 Will Wheatons. I mean, either way, it's still a hundred. Let's not uh, let's not upturn our noses here. Uh, when I swing my no, the... do not shout. We live on that lake. <laughs> Whatever you do, do not shout. You are banned from shouting. Okay, we will give you all the food we'll, you we'll, need. We'll put you and Pawn in a room and just keep feeding you. Oh my God! How do you eat that much? Um, or did he just get nothing but Wagyu beef and like, is it just added up? I was going to say, he's going the River City Ransom route. The reason he has the strength of a hundred men is he has been eating in here the entire game. <laughs> All right. So we have to show up the cash to get him in the party. So, yep. I think he's one of two characters that you have to buy into loyalty. Right. Kage the other? Yes. Yeah. I don't, I don't think I'm spoiling too much when I, I say Mr. Yeah, the, like, the ninja for hire right. is for hire. Huh? Another elf. Hey, a survivor. 
I mean, that'd be a pretty good reason to be in there. I don't, I don't think anyone would be mad at you for that. Eh. Oh, okay. Be that way. Wow. Alright, so yeah, this is the character you that Kirkus has to be level 40, 40 for. Alright, so you have to convince Ruby that you are strong. Yes. Gotcha. And then there's still the second Kobold. Yeah, which I think is in this house. And and the art for this guy, by the way, is just a dog. Aww. <laughs> like it's not even a, that's not even a kobold. They just put a dog with a scarf, and that's that's gone. That's internet's gone. favorite character. <laughs> Why don't you capitalize, Big Brother? Is there something you need to tell us, Kuro Mimi? Hmm, that's a good point. Who controls Whatever. the past? Controls the future. In the party. You can bark against the machine in the tower. <laughs> uh, yes, we just told him that. Who's a good boy? Who's a good <laughs> just boy? Like wags. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's one that won't be joining the party. You can stand. I love the kibble on the table. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a, a dog bowl. It's, it's an it's, actual like Alpo. It's it's. <laughs> Also, did you notice they had their own dog portrait on the wall? Did they really? Yeah. I, how many times did they keep going back into this house? I mean, it's the little <laughs> things, right? Isn't that great? Like, what a nice little detail to add. Huh. Well done. And did you also... <laughs> go away. Uh, what do you got? Mm. Nothing I need. Yeah. Sell all the things. The, yeah. Uh, don't need that. Or that. You do need the white paint, right? I do need the white paint. I think I can even sell it. Yeah. 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 Not for sale. Alright, we are flush with cash. Good. We will need it. Yeah. I don't need that many medicines. Yep. Make some room. Cool. I'm pretty sure with that much, I can outfit Pond with whatever I want at this point. True. We're getting close to that moment. Yeah. Uh, actually, no. There's no. still like a, a couple of big things that have to happen. That first. is a very reasonable price. Only thirty bits. Oh, really? Yep. Hundred and eighty for the whole. Yeah. Oh, per, per creature. Per creature. They don't even judge. I like it. All right. Well, I think this is a good place to stop. Uh, yeah, sure. Next time we'll walk back to the castle. I think we might be able to get one or two more characters along the way. Yeah. Yeah, and then. Uh, this we'll cool. we'll, we'll so, pick up to see what all good we've accomplished by saving what's left of the elves and the kobolds. Yeah, we're probably up to like 14 floors in the tower by now. <laughs> Going by that level of progress, yeah. yeah. It's got a water slide. <laughs> D-ball. That would pretty much be the best thing, but unfortunately there's no water slide NPC in this That's game. That's what they ought to do. Like, what they're missing is, um, like, Suicoden Party. <laughs> and it's just like 200 mini games based around the tower. And it's actually like moving through the tower as the board, and it's just all these weird board games featuring characters. I mean, it beats Pachinko. Yeah. Get on it, Konami. We'll see y'all next time.